welcome back again to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be showing you guys sharing you my techniques on how to make my wing eyeliner on fleek now this video has been requested by a lot of you guys because you probably noticed that I always do a wing eyeliner in my tutorials it's something that I have in my blood before we get started on the tutorial I'm gonna warn you guys that my eyes are not really symmetrical this part of my face is there's something wrong with this kind of just like my eyebrows here this is my bad brow this is my bad eyes because with this eye it's kind of a little bit puffier and my lids are a little bit wider than this eye I hope you will understand another thing is that please don't get mad if you would find this not okay or too hard to do like a lot of steps this is really how I do my wing eyeliner every time I sit down do my makeup I have three hours to do my face and I know there is a big big joke when it comes to doing wing eyeliner on social media I mean memes are everywhere in videos of girls doing their eyeliner on the other side being on flick and then on the other one it's like I'm in trouble that is why I want to break it down to you guys make it as simple as possible so that you can have an on fleek eyeliner every day of your life anyways without any further ado if you want to see how to get this on fleek eyeliner then just keep on watching So the first tool that you're gonna be needing is a flat angle brush now what I have in here is a Sigma small angle e65 you can use any brush that you desire because sometimes people tend to choose a angle brush or a pointed brush or something that is thin and just like this like sharp or angled like that depends on their um, preference this is for me the best brush when it comes to doing eyeliners and using cream because we are going to be using a cream stuff and for today I'm going to be using the morphe um, eyeliner cream eyeliner black and you can use any um, cream eyeliner that you want if you're gonna use a ColourPop cream gel do keep in mind that those cream gels are very 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 easily to dry out so you have to keep that in mind because I've tried to use that cream gel and it does tug your skin your lids and it's painful if you're so okay with that that's totally fine but for me I really don't recommend it because I can't bear it that's all I can say so I'm just gonna get a little bit of product at the very tip on it make sure that your brush is clean and there's no additional product on both sides because that can kind of ruin the sharp line that you want on that part you know okay so I want you to be in a position where you're kind of leaning on the side where the light is and put your mirror like this just like that you know okay because it gives me more of a control on where my wing is gonna be because you don't want it like this you don't want it there you want it to follow your line here so you want to start with very very light strokes and if you are contented with how long it is already you can start releasing the pressure at the very tip of it so that the tip would be thin and sharp because that is just what wing eyeliner is for sharp as a knife okay so I like to start my eyeliner routine like this because I have more control when it comes to how long I'm going to be not like no I'm gonna finish this eye and oh my goodness how am I gonna start this side that this is kind of like the simplest way I can give it to you guys um, start your line first the wing part and then do it on the other side as well so you can kind of like measure if it's the both of them is going on the same path it makes it easier and we'll be doing the same thing on the other side as well start with light strokes and at the very tip release the pressure so you would have that thin and sharp line okay so this is the first step and um, you can actually correct it if it's not that symmetrical as you want the both lines to be next step is we are gonna start to make it look like it's a wing eyeliner okay so on this part you don't want to start at the very very tip of the line that we just created because that is gonna leave us the drama that every wing eyeliner has to have so you gotta start three-fourths way from the line that we created and leave that thin sharp line up there okay so as you can tell I am going very very thick but as I make my way to the center of the lids it's kind of a little bit thinner and through my inner eye corners it's much much thinner because that's just how wing eyeliner is supposed to be very sexy and dramatic 
This is the second to the hardest steps that we're gonna have. Um, the first one was making that thing symmetrical and everything because filling this up is as easy as one, two, three. Okay, so as you can tell, I didn't start from the very, very tip of the line that we did first. I didn't start like from the very, very tip of it because you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. You want to keep that little, little line there, like sharp line there because that's going to make it like, you know what I mean? Like as sharp as a knife. I don't even know what that sound was. Even though this is the easiest part, please still be careful when it comes to filling this up because this can be a disaster still. So yeah, just watch out for that. This completes this eyeliner tutorial. And that was it that completes this how to make your eyeliner on flick video I hope you guys enjoyed this video and most of all learned how to make this and I hope you will try this steps at home like the techniques that I have for you guys I really really hope you would try this at home if it doesn't work for you sometimes people just has certain steps that will really really work with them and this is mine anyways thank you all guys again so much for watching if you don't follow me on my social media accounts everything is linked down below my snapchat my instagram and my facebook and please subscribe if you haven't already that would really mean a lot to me don't forget to click the thumbs up if you did like this video comment down below what you think and i will see you guys on my next video bye